Hi team. Today we're going to do our core conditioning. So same format, 45 seconds on, 15 seconds off, two rounds, five exercises, you know the drill. And just know that if you need to take a break, if you need to grab water, if you need to pause the video, please do. Every day is different for our bodies. Every day you just have to drop into that awareness of the body and understand how you feel today from an individual perspective and then just respond to that. But you showed up, I'm so proud of you. Let's get into it right away. So first one is going to be footwork. So as if I had a mat here, I'm gonna go on, on, off the mat, on, on, off the mat, or almost like on, in a ring, out of the ring. Just basically move your feet. Here we go, in three, two, one, in, in, out, in, in, out. So get that feet, get those feet moving, get your heart rate up. If you wanna slow it down, you can, but I encourage you to speed it up because again, we're not here for that long. We're gonna use those arms. <laughs> breathe, start to breathe. Start to work on that pattern through the nose, out the nose or the mouth. <laughs> Especially for the cardio version of this, we wanna at least breathe through the nose, but then you can breathe out the mouth because it definitely can become intense. <laughs> Stay with me. Stay light on those feet, no pounding. You can always step if it's too much on the knees. Almost there for three, two, one, rest. Excellent. Next one is gonna be our little split hop. So you can, if it doesn't feel good, you can just step it back. If it feels good, you're gonna hop it back. So wherever you are, stay low in those legs. Three, Two, one, here we go. Lower and lift. Stay light, stay agile, and make it your own. So again, option to step and step. I'm just gonna keep your heart rate up. It's gonna get into those legs. Or you can hop. Hinging at the hip, torso is about 45 degrees of the floor. Light on those feet. You're doing great. Keep it up. Stay with me. Nice. We're almost there. We have about 10 seconds remaining. Five, four, three, two, one, rest, breathe. Nice job. Okay. We're gonna squat and kick. Squat and kick. If that kick is too much, just squat. Again, making it your own workout. Here we go. Three, two, one, Lower and lift. Nice. So this cardio workout is so good for daily life, but it's also a great thing to add in when you're traveling. A lot of times, at least for me, I don't find I have the time or even the energy to track down a gym or a class when I'm traveling. So I'll incorporate these moves 10, 5, 10, 15 minutes in a day maybe before I start my day in my hotel room. And it really can make a huge difference. Sets up our metabolism, gets us into that fat burning state. Last two and one. Whew, two more. And we're gonna pause and reset. Next one is gonna be similar to that the work we started with, but you're gonna cross over, out, out, cross over, out, out. It's like a little dance step. Three, two, one, let's do it. So when we cross over, we're gonna spin those hips. And just the movement of the separation between your lower and upper body is gonna create new energy flow. So a lot of times when we're sitting, our meridians, our areas in the body that can help pass energy, get locked up or blocked. And what we wanna do is open those up. So. Any kind, anytime you can separate lower and upper body like this, we're doing any kind of yoga practice, that's gonna start to help open up those meridians. Nice. Almost there, last three, two, one, release. Breathe, slow it down. It's a lot of hopping around. So for this last one, we're just gonna do low pulses. Staying low, you should definitely feel this in your legs. We're just gonna pulse. So from the side, I'm over my entire foot bed, and I'm pulsing. 
Ready and go for it. Small little pulses right into those quads, right into the glutes. Breathe. Nice. So the challenge is to stay calm, stay focused in the midst of these high energy, much tougher exercises. Through that is the breath. Nice. We got this. Doing so well. I'm definitely feeling my quads. Hopefully you are. It's killer. Nice. This is a good one for the little black dress for the gals. For the guys, it might be a little funny, but it definitely is effective. And rest. Slow down your breathing. We have it one, this whole series one more time, then we'll move on. Whew. Okay. Here we go. We're going to go step in, in, out, in, in, out. In three, two, one, let's go. In, in, out, in, in, out. Fast feet, fast feet. Stay light on those feet. You're on the balls of your feet, not on your heels. Use those arms for momentum. And again, if this at all doesn't feel good for your body, step, step off, step, step off. Maybe add a high knee. So you're actually really working your entire body here, whether you're going fast or slow. Nice. Last time here, stay with it. We're almost done. Breathe. Nice. Quick feet, last three, two, one, rest. We're gonna go from that low, slow lunge, and we're gonna do the little hop in the low lunge. Here we go. And option to step or hop. Go for it. Stay low. Breathe with me. Woo! We're doing great. This is not easy. This workout always kicks my butt, but then it's done in 10 minutes. It's the best. And then you have more energy for the higher level tasks. As leaders, we want to Make sure we're setting up our body as our foundation for our brain. Ooh, we got this. Nice job. Almost there. Stay low. Last five, four, three, two, rest. Well done. Slow it down, breathe. You need to squat and kick, squat and kick. And Stay with me. We got this. Lower and lift. Here we go. So just commit. Know that it's 45 seconds. Our bodies can handle anything for 45 seconds. And we're in it. We're moving. We're already 15 seconds in. So just know that sometimes it's mental. Sometimes it's physical, for sure. Sometimes it does not feel good on our body. But just check in with that. Check in and see if it is just the mental block that we are experiencing or physical. Nice. Almost there. Five, four, get those legs up. Talking to myself. Really sweet. We're gonna slow it down. It's still gonna be tough. But we're gonna do crossover, out, out, crossover, out, out. Nice. Use those arms. Get that upper body and lower body separation. Three, two, one, let's do it. Twist and twist. And maybe add a little extra twist. You can slow it way down here or speed it up. This is our last time here. So make it your own. Maybe add a little flare. Nice. Maybe crank up the music. Almost there, you guys, let's go. Stay with me. Breathe, inhale through the nose. Exhale through the nose. Smile, it helps, I promise. Stay strong. You're doing so well. Last five, four, two, rest. Exceptional. Last one is gonna be our squat pulses. We'll send you off on your day. Feet hip width apart, lower down, and start to pulse. Little pulses at the bottom. Well done, we're just going right into it. Our legs should be on fire. 
Again, from the side, I'm not rounding, I'm staying upright. Breathe with me. Super strong. We got this. Maybe close your eyes for the last few. Feel your strength. And then the last one, just for fun, let's stay low and hold. Close your eyes, building strength within stillness. Recognizing how hard your legs just were. That way, really fall forward. Let your head go. You're booting that circulation through the brain. All the way up, and arms up. Exhale, gentle back bend. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Super strong. Well done today. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you soon.